Hello everyone, welcome back to Scented Moments channel. I'm Jolima and today I will tell you how to build a niche fragrance collection without breaking the bank. Of course, niche fragrances are more expensive, but I wanted to do a part two uh, video because on my previous video I talked about how to build a fragrance collection without breaking the bank more into the designer realm of things. Link here so you can check that video out if you have yet to. So now I will talk about niche fragrances and you are diving into niche perfumery and before you start to hoard uh, niche fragrances because quite frankly you don't need hundreds of niche perfumes. You just need maybe six, um, five or six fragrances to rotate with. So I will use the same criteria as I used on my previous video. So let's start. Uh, first you need a Swiss Army type of scent. You need a fragrance where you that you will wear through the entire year in all type of seasons and occasions Perfect fragrance for that is from the house of Nishane and it is Hashivat. This one right here. I already did a review of Hashivat, so I will leave the link here so you can check that video out. This it's quite often compared with Creed Aventus or Avantus. Um, I understand why it's get compared with Aventus, but Quite frankly, this is much better than Aventus, in my opinion. The pineapple note here, it's much more prominent. You have the bergamot in the top. You have, it's more creamy, you have vanilla, and you have oak moss. This is a fruity Chypre scent. Perfect for all year round. Performance, it's outstanding. Like all Nishane fragrances, this is an extrait de parfum concentration. Quite appealing, you will get noticed while wearing this one. You can wear this in the office, casual scenarios, night out, date nights, you name it. Perfect Swiss Army type of scent is Hashivat by Nishane. Outstanding scent. A fragrance that you will also need, maybe, it's a fragrance for the warm weather, for the spring and summertime. Perfect fragrance for that. It's from the house of Sergeov and it is Renaissance. This one right here, a fantastic scent, the best mint fragrance that I ever smelled. Man, so natural smelling, so fresh, green and herbal. You have also one of the best openings ever made, citruses. You have a blast of citruses right on the top, very natural smelling. You have orange, mandarin orange, you have bergamot, you have lemon and followed by uh, mint. What a outstanding opening and this for a fresh fragrance lasts for a very long time. This is the most long lasting fresh fragrance that I have in my collection. Renaissance by Sergeov, perfect for spring and summer. It's outstanding. Renaissance by Sergeov, this is a 100ml bottle size and will run you for 200 euros retail. So not that bad, especially for a Sergeov. Fantastic, natural smelling, soothing, comforting and refreshing scent. Renaissance, it's fantastic for the warmer weather. Next fragrance that you might need, it's a fragrance for a more colder day, for the more colder days, for fall and winter time. And this, if you're starting uh, to discover niche fragrances, this is a must have. From the house of Andy Tower, the fragrance is L'air du désert marocain. This is already a classic, a iconic fragrance from any tower. This is a masterpiece of an amber. Man, this is dry, it's dusty, it's very spicy and ambery. It really feels that you are in the Moroccan desert. Man, this is out of this world, it's very realistic. It really sets you into a mood and place. Fantastic scent for the colder days, quite elegant, sophisticated, very unique. Any tower, L'Air du Désert Marocain, it's a must have for niche beginners. It's fantastic. Uh, this is where I started to discover more niche fragrances, especially amber based scents. This is the reason why I love amber fragrances. Any tower, L'Air du Désert Marocain, it's a must have perfect for the colder weather, fall and winter time. Now the next fragrance that you might need, it's a fragrance for date night scenarios. Perfect fragrance for that, it's from the house of 
Profumum Roma and it is Dulcis in Fundo. You all know how much I love Profumum Roma fragrances and this one it's delicious. This has a blast of citruses again but most prominent it's but the most prominent citrus note here it's orange followed by a delicious creamy realistic sweet vanilla scent what an outstanding fragrance this is an orange creamsicle in a bottle delicious realistic very appealing sensual seductive perfect for date night occasions Dutis in Fundo by Profumo Roma will shine during the most during the more intimate scenarios next fragrance that you might need for a night out occasion where you will grab some drinks with your friends go to have a nice dinner out perfect fragrance from the house of Stefano Mer Lucas it is Unui Adoa what a fantastic under the radar scent actually so good I already did a review of this fragrance when we had a while I will leave the link here so you can check that review out this is a fantastic tobacco scent with cinnamon you have vanilla in here you have leather it's to die for it's addictive it's cozy it's it has some mysterious vibes into it um, but this is a blend of Tobacco Vini by Tom Ford and Soleil de Jeddah by the same brand. Mix those two fragrances into this fantastic, addictive, cozy, sensual scent. You will get noticed with Unui Adoa. It's fantastic. Man, wonderful, wonderful scent. Unui Adoa, perfect for night out scenarios, I think. This will work perfect for that. Try this one if you have yet to, especially if you love spicy tobacco, sweet, leathery fragrances. This one is a must try. And finally, you want a fragrance for the more formal events where you want to stand out in a crowd. A very special fragrance. From House of Amouage, it is Jubilation 25. Wow, this is my favorite Amouage and what a regal scent this is the most or the or one of the most regal fragrances that i ever smelled this has blackberry a very prominent note of blackberry very fruity very resinous you have myrrh you have a open axe you have frankincense in here you have oud it's simply outstanding it's resinous it's balsamic it's woodsy this is sweet but not overly sweet it's quite woody in the base it's fruity it's very complex and yet quite linear from the note considering the note breakdown of amouage jubilation 25 but nonetheless a refined regal opulent scent i love this one Jubilation 25 by amouage is a masterpiece very long lasting and if you want to stand out in a crowd this is the one to go. Jubilation 25 by Amouage finishes this video. Guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Tell me in the comments down below what you thought of this video. What fragrances would you wear in this type of occasion, especially if you were starting to uh, dive into niche fragrances. And see you in the next one. Take care. Ciao.